Right, hey guys, welcome to another weekly vlog, I guess. I'm trying to be a little bit more consistent with my YouTube channel. I know that I haven't really been all that consistent, but yeah. Welcome back. School has started. It is officially the second week of school. So yeah, I'm just trying to uh, like get into it, trying to get into the groove of things. So yeah, I just finished my class for today. It was literally like two and a half hours. Could not guarantee that I was paying attention the whole time, but I am very thankful for the like online lectures or whatever so I can re-watch the lecture. Yeah, lately I've just been struggling kind of with like my motivation. Like I don't really, I don't know. I don't know if it's cause like I'm not on campus and I'm like still at home and I feel a little bit of FOMO, you know, and I'm usually not one to do that, but I don't know. I just feel very like isolated, if that makes sense. Like I feel like everybody's back on campus going back to school like most of my friends are back at school doing their own thing so i i feel like i don't really have anyone to like hang out with um or like i don't have friends <laughs> which sounds kind of depressing but yeah not necessarily like sad but i don't know it's it's a weird feeling but anyways i thought i would do some yoga to kind of Help cheer me up a little bit so i did that i did a 15 minute practice and i do i do feel better <laughs> so if you guys need like a little pick me up i would highly recommend doing like a short yoga practice i know that just getting your body moving and stretching a little bit definitely helps um at least for me but that is the update for now so i hope you guys enjoy this weekly vlog our time is a luxury, also seeks your company. Let's get each other up to speed. Yeah. Hi guys. Wow, I look <laughs> I look kind of crazy. I did take a nap earlier and then I worked on some work stuff for the past like hour. But yeah, so I've been working as a student worker for um usc's like classical radio station type thing and actually i've been really enjoying it it's been pretty fun it's basically like i'm managing kind of like their social media stuff and just kind of making sure that i post regularly blah 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 that's been fun i feel like i've been doing a lot of like social media stuff but yeah it is now 5 30 i have some homework to do which is really sad but I also want to make time to crochet today because as you saw in the last clip, I got my crochet hooks in the mail. Yes, I've been recently getting back into crocheting um, and I made like a little bag, which was very cute. Kind of bad, but I mean, not bad. Um, so I'm planning on making like a glasses case because my grandma has requested one. So I will do that for her. Up your hills, and I said, Oh, wet up on the still. Dolly brush truck with the canvas. Gotta let the paint dry. Burn, burn, make us feel fine. Body heat, make the skin cry. Baby, babe, it's a good night. When we wake up, still on the best side. Pillows, hearts, our symphony. Souls connect so physically, yeah. Comes to shine like laser beams. Wanna feel your energy. Okay, this is my attempt at a breakfast burrito. Not that great, but let's give it a try. Don't mind how I look right now, okay. Okay guys, so I finished eating my breakfast burrito, very good, and I'm probably gonna do some homework now. I was actually on TikTok for the past 20 minutes, but <laughs> a package just came for me that I have been waiting for. Um, this is from India actually, so I ordered off an Etsy shop 
um, for some tapestries. As you can see, I took my tapestry down. I don't know, I was getting kind of sick of it. So I bought a couple new ones. So I'm very excited. So I got one that was like a little bit more brown in color. So I guess I'll open them up and show you guys. Ooh, these feel nice. Okay, so it's like this mandala type design. And then I got this one, which is more like blue, green. Oh, these are actually really big. And the material is really, really nice. Oh, this one's quite cute as well. Breathing energy with a bit of Hennessy. We want skies and autumn leaves. Take all the chances that we need. Yay, here's my new tapestry. It is a little bit smaller than my previous one, I will say, but it's so cute. I love it. Um, so I will link the Etsy shop down below if you guys are interested. I must say the quality is super nice compared to my old one. I don't know, the fabric just seems a lot more like nicer. I don't know, the fabric just seems like better quality. But yeah, I'm digging this like color scheme. It's very fall. So I feel like when I get tired of this tapestry, I can go ahead and switch it out with this one because this one is also really, really nice. But I don't know. I just like this one for right now. And then we will go ahead and try this out. Maybe during the winter, I don't know. Gets out of control If only we knew how to close I promise I'll hold your hand Till it gets old And all the lights come to a close Okay, you guys, I've literally just finished class And it's 9.04 p.m. And I have the biggest headache. I had to pull out my blue light glasses because my eyes were starting to strain and I was like starting to feel shitty. Wow, these night classes really are so draining. I don't know if I prefer morning classes or night classes. I definitely prefer afternoon classes because during the morning classes, I'm like so sleepy that I can't keep my eyes open. And the night classes, I just, I get so freaking bored and my eyes strain and my head hurts <laughs> yes but anyways i will end today here i'm gonna go shower <laughs> Hey guys, just wanted to update you. I haven't really done much today. I've just been in class, but I've spent the past like hour watching Cathro, but I've been watching her videos on how she, basically her journey on being, becoming like a leftist and like her radicalization journey and just kind of breaking free from the corporate culture that we have questioning the structure of society etc etc yeah i just feel like her videos have really validated kind of my my opinions of like not wanting to be a part of corporate culture and not really being excited to be a part of that life and have that be my life but yeah recently after being in college i'm like dude i'm so like not excited to become a part of corporate culture i'm so not excited to work and just like spend the rest of my life working for a company that doesn't give two shits about me like i just i don't want to do it and but obviously there's like this pressure from my family from society from my friends from my peers from my school from literally everywhere telling me that this is the path that i need to take and this is the thing that i need to do this is the thing that's right to do and i'm just like i've been grappling with that for the past couple of years as i'm getting ready to graduate and, and putting the student life part of my life to a close and i don't know just watching her has been really validating like my experience and my thoughts 
and yeah i just wanted to share like if you guys are feeling the same way i think it's definitely something to like look into and obviously like your feelings are valid uh, i don't know it's all very real right now because i do realize that i have that my time being a student is very limited and i do eventually have to like go out into the real world and do shit and make money because i gotta support myself right so i don't know those are just some of the thoughts that i'm having so that is my wednesday update for you all that's pretty much all i've been doing hello you guys sorry i have not vlogged this entire day today it's currently 6 24 p.m i'm about to go eat dinner i uh, so pretty much i slept in today i woke up at 1 p.m um very much needed sleeping in um rest day i finished my homework assignment today though so that's pretty good for the rest of the weekend i just need to do some reading um so honestly i'm not stressing um yeah today was a very much needed like rest day sleep in day type of thing other than sleeping i went grocery shopping with my mom ran some errands um so yeah let's go get dinner hi guys happy friday so it is currently 12 52 p.m i woke up early today um i did some homework i didn't do quite as much as i wanted to but i do have the rest of the day but I just wanted to take a break, a little breather, take a day for myself, take myself out on a date. Because I feel like I don't really do that. I don't really go out by myself and like do things. So I'm going to try and not, not let my social anxiety take control. So I've been craving this coffee from a specific uh, coffee place that is in downtown so i'm gonna go there and then also there's like this art museum that i used to intern for i'm gonna lock my doors make sure to lock your doors um yeah so i used to intern at this art museum and they're having a new like art exhibit so i wanted to i wanted to go check that out and then i may or may not go to like a bookstore yeah i'm excited so let's go If you are in the downtown San Jose area, I would highly recommend checking Makla out and supporting um, artists and local artists. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna head back now. Okay, you guys, I'm back. I am sweating. It is so hot outside. I did not know it was gonna be this hot, but First, I was really stressed out about this parking garage because there's literally nobody here. Like, there's nobody here. And I was like, uh, this is weird. But I was gonna park in like my usual spot where I used to park for my internship. But I forgot that today's Friday and they usually do this thing every Friday called South First, oh wait, no, not every Friday. The first Friday of every month called South First Fridays. And I think they're like preparing for that. So all the roads were blocked and I was like, I forgot. And plus they were doing like a farmer's market. I think they were doing a farmer's market earlier. Whew, I'm out of breath. 
They're doing a farmer's market earlier this afternoon slash morning. And so that road was blocked off. So a lot of roads were blocked off. So I pretty much had no choice but to park in here or to park like a little bit further away, but it's all good. I made it back. Next, I think I am going to check out that bookstore. Yeah. Oh my gosh you guys that was so like therapeutic i spent a good half an hour in there maybe close to an hour it's so there's so many books and i cannot believe that most of them are all used i'm trying not to spend as much money because i'm broke but nonetheless i got i picked up some books i spent like 50 bucks there but <laughs> I'm not mad because it's supporting a local business. I think they've been in business for like 40 years, which is crazy. I've never even heard of this place, but it was just so relaxing. And then just something about bookstores just really get me going. So I picked up a couple of books that sounded really interesting. I got Crazy Rich Asians because I watched the movie, but I haven't read the book. I wanted to read it, okay? So sue me for being a basic bitch. I also got this book, Crying in H Mart, which I've been wanting to get for a really long time. So I got that and then I also got this book, which is called The Vegetarian. I think this was a Korean novel and it was translated it it was translated into English, but this seems really interesting, so and it seems pretty short. So I don't know, I feel like I could finish it pretty fast. And then last but not least, I guess, I got this book called Already Free. It's like, Buddhism meets psychotherapy on the path of liberation. I don't know, it sounded interesting. I'm kind of at this point where I want to learn more about like, more spiritual stuff. And also psychotherapy, I thought it was a cool like mesh of both like, Eastern philosophy and Western philosophy. So that could be interesting. I don't know if this is going to be good, but I mean, we'll see. But definitely buying used, three of these were used. So definitely buying the used ones were a lot cheaper than if I were to buy like a new copy. <sighs> I just feel good. This is, this is a great idea. I'm very happy. But next I'm gonna probably try to go to CVS or Target or something to run some errands. And I also really got a piece, so yeah. Also, that cat in there was so stinking cute. Like, it reminded me of Yuki, but black. So cute. All right, let's go. did my nightly yoga that I've been doing. Um, if you guys are curious, I've been following the Yoga with Adrian September playlist. So that's been really fun. I also did this workout, this arm workout by Caroline Gervin. Hopefully it's not Gervin. I, I think it's Gervin. Yes, I tried her arm workout today and, and it's my first time trying one of her workout videos extremely hard i don't know if it's because i haven't been like lifting weights it's been probably like a month or so now since i've like done a weightlifting workout i feel like for the most part i've been if i'm doing anything at all i'm doing yoga which has been it's been really nice getting back into yoga and just kind of like moving with my breath and being more mindful of that um, definitely stress relieving 
and it just feels good. Um, so I've been enjoying yoga, but I was feeling a little bit spicy today. I thought I would do a weight training workout. Um, and now my arms feel like jello. So even holding on my phone to record this is actually hurting. So yes, anyways, I wanted to end my vlog here. Thank you guys so much for spending this week with me. I will hopefully see you guys next week. More than